from pole position. It was Albert Costa who got jumped off the line by the Imperial Racing Lamborghinis as they surged towards turn one. Victor Bouveng also in the thick of the action. It's the huge field charged towards the first corner. It was Mapelli who took the advantage from Christian Engelhart behind the several cars round wide. Craig Dolby got caught in a skittle effect and sadly the Wessex vehicle's Lamborghini into the tyre wall and out of the race. The opening exchanges were typically frantic. Zalbert Costa sought to carve his way up through the field after losing some ground at the start and eventually was up into second in pursuit of Marco Mapelli as Duncan Tappy came together with Rinaldi Racing. Ferrari, meanwhile, Victor Bouveng, as he went to the pit stop, just misjudged his entry in that got he and Fran Raider a five second penalty so post pit stops leading the way it was Giovanni Venturini with Mikel Mack and Fran Raider in close pursuit sadly for Philip Frommerville in the ML Frey Racing Lexus the car suddenly stopping on him bringing out the safety car and despair for Albert Costa the championship cut charge came to a close meanwhile there was some frenetic fighting in the Pro-Am class, which came to head as Pier Giuseppe Perizzini and Alain Cadet collided. So it was victory for Giovanni Venturini and Marco Mapelli. Second to Mikel Mack and Miguel Ramos. And third to Mario and Dominic Farnbacher. Fourth to Rueda and Bouven keeps them in the championship fight, whilst third in the Pro-Am class is enough to give Sean Balf and Robert Bell victory in the Pro-Am championship.